Well, we got tornadoes by us. So the sep safest thing one can do is get these horses out on pasture away from buildings and flying debris. So I'm out here with a tornado right over there somewhere. And I'm gonna get them out and give them more room to move. Whoa, see that? That way, if anything happens, they can go down over the hill. Tornado should come from that direction. Should move out that way, but you can't be sure. So, putting them out in here. Sabrina, do you hear Stormy? Uh-oh, I think I just got hit with a hail, piece of hail. So we just got an alumni, a horse that used to be with us, just got her in. I'm contemplating. I think I'm going to have to let her out with the herd, which will create distri dis ish uh, sorry, distress for everybody. But I can't leave her up here with all of these buildings. So this mare right here, Sabrina, is wanting her to be with her. So hopefully they'll pair up together and everybody will be safe. Stormy, I don't want you up here in case there's a problem. So head on out. Go on, baby girl. Go on, Sabrina. Take care of her. Okay, got lightning flashing everywhere. Again, getting the horses out on pasture away from possible issues related to um, blowing debris and hoping that the reported tornado, which you might be able to see right there, we're about 15, 20 miles away, uh, goes that direction, which is north and east, and ends up over there. But you know what? There are people all along the way from where the reported tornado is on the ground. Might be able to, I don't know for sure if that's it, where it's really light right in the center of the screen or if it's hidden within the clouds right there shrouded in rain i know we're not getting much rain thank goodness the skies are not green yet there's rain everywhere around us except to the south as you can see and we are desperately in need of rain the horses are not too worried but that's not uncommon for them. And again, if weather comes through, they can get on the other side of the hill that you can't see from here and get some protection. We do not want them under trees. We do not want them in buildings. It is blowing debris that kills horses rather than the craziness that you saw in the Twister movies, which showed you cows picked up and blown, yes. Animals, cars, etc. they do get picked up and they do get blown, but that's usually not the case. As a matter of fact, and a side story, we were part of the, what was known as the Andover, Kansas tornado about 30 years ago, maybe 35, not sure, can't remember. 91, when would that have been? Uh, about 89, I think. Anyway, doesn't matter. Um, and at that time I had two horses on my property. Both of the horses were picked up by the tornado that we got hit by. One of them was put back down in the pasture, no problem. The other was picked up, taken out of the pasture, set over the fence and underneath trees. And she was okay. But the trees broke off at about 12 feet and then the rest of the tree broke off over the top of her. And that told us where the tail of the tornado had been because immediately behind our property, it began destroying everything rather than just severely damaging everything. So anyway, I'm heading in y'all. Hope you're safe. If you're in Kansas, if you're someplace else, maybe you're not dealing with this, but we all got to deal, deal with things no matter where we are, don't we? Take care.